Welcome back to Flying Dutchman Cards. Got a couple returns to go through today, so we will go ahead and check these out. So let's get started here. First up, uh, Kansas City, Missouri. So let's see what we got here. So don't know who this is, so we will find out together. Oh, nice. Looks like we got <clears throat> something on an index card. That's always fun. Oh, look. Oh, that's mine that I sent him. This is, oh, very cool. This is Mr. Bob Speak. So this is another uh, vintage card that, um, yeah, that I had. Saw that he signed, thought I'd throw it out there. It's not in the best condition, but um, yeah, I thought that'd be kind of cool. Um, so yeah, yeah, and he wrote on the back of mine, just God bless you guys. Very cool. So yeah, Bob speak. Um, that's a pretty awesome Giants logo. I don't remember that. I, I, I've, I've seen that one before, but, um, yeah. Interesting part two is outfielder. I don't know if that would be necessarily an outfielder's throw. Maybe they just had him posing and taking pictures. I um, probably should have cleaned it up a little bit, but yeah, very cool. A little bit of his stats there on the back. So this is 59 tops. So, oh, he's from Springfield, Missouri. Very cool. Nice, so that's first one up. Next one we got here is from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Let's see what we got. This one feels a little bit thicker. So I think we've got more than one. I got my letter back. Oh, nice. Okay, what do we got here? Oh, we got a 89 tops on the back. So this is Doug Desenzo. Very cool. So this one I thought, um, yeah, so, so he played for the Cubs, obviously, back in the day. Um, this one I thought was awesome. Uh, Obviously, he's an outfielder, not a pitcher. Wanted to get a pitcher or wanted to get a card signed by someone who wasn't a pitcher pitching. So that's pretty cool. And I wonder if he gets that one often. So first up, 91 score. The next we have 90 upper deck. I thought this was just a cool kind of action shot. You know, as he's leaving the box, got the dirt stain on his jersey. You can see the brick at Wrigley. Very cool. 91 leaf very nice that's a cool one too laying down the bunt 90 89 not 90 89 score rookie card with the awesome cubs logo there so cool and then our last one here we have our 89 tops nice one to get signed so yeah, I saw that, saw that a bunch of people were getting his his cards back, so I thought I would send out to him. So Doug Desenzo. Very cool. Yeah, so I, I thought this was kind of an interesting... Some good action shots there and uh, of him pitching. So I'll have to look up, have to look up what game game it was that he pitched. Must have been in... I'm assuming in 90. But... Um, oh, here it is. Highland 90 season occurred on the mound rather than the outfield in the 198 drubbing. Became the first position player to pitch in 13 years. See front of card. That's awesome. So. Love one hit and one of five cub, cub pitchers to hold the Mets scoreless. Very cool. Yeah. It, it's funny now because I feel like there's pitchers or position players pitch like all the time now. So it's funny. They've been 13 years in between. So. Sweet. Next one up here is from San Jose, California. Take a look what we got. Get this one open. Oh, nice. So right here we have Mark Icorn. So he was a reliever, um, pitched for the Blue Jays and the Angels, a couple other teams as well. Uh, but he was kind of a, a sidearm submarine 
picture. I, I love all the different, different, uh, you know, you have three quarters, then sidearm, then submarine, and then, you know, crazy things. So, um, but yeah, so this is, this is pretty sweet signature. It's got a signature, his number on there. Um, Philippians 413, cool Bible verse. Oh yeah, it looks like each one has its own different Bible verse. Very cool. So this is, um, yeah, first up was 91 upper deck and then 89 score with the awesome uh, blue Blue Jays uniforms. Very cool. So, and then 92 score. Very cool. You can kind of see his, his wind up there. And then, oh yes, this one's awesome. So I feel like there's a couple things here. One, uh, landscape cards are awesome. Two, he's like looks like he's signing autographs for, you know, a bunch of you know servicemen or something like that. So I always think it's it's awesome. I think this yeah one of my first ones that I've gotten, where he's I have a signature of him signing autographs. <laughs> so I like the, uh, you know the the repetition there. So very cool. Ninety two upper deck and then last here we have 89 tops very cool oh interesting too he put his yeah it must have been he must have been number 38 that year so i'm gonna look back on his other oh yeah for the for the uh the blue jays he he was number 38 so not bad i think they didn't have a great pen there but um kind of got a little bit of my 89 tops stuff on there so yeah i remember he had um oh yeah i guess i've been on this one 87 he was he had a couple couple years where he um as a yeah, as a reliever just had some monster yeah 86 14 and 6 10 saves 1.72 era 166 strikeouts so ripping it up well, it comes from a family of seven children. Accomplished impressionist. Very nice. Cool. Well, that's what we got for today. So we got, uh, first up, we had Bob Speak. Um, vintage return. Very nice. From 59 tops there. And then uh, next up, Doug Desenzo. Got five cards there. So we got the... Uh, um, 89 tops, 89 score, 91 leaf, 90 upper deck, and 91 score of him pitching. And then Mark Eichhorn, got five of those as well. So there we go. So bunch more to add to the collection. Hope you guys enjoyed this and we'll see you next time.